there we go. Just got the ice fishing shelter set up. Um, I forgot boots, unfortunately. Oh, oh my gosh. Let's go. First fish of the season, baby. Let's get it. Me and Tayden just got the ice fishing shelter set up. There we go, that bluegill. Let's go, first fish, Hey, That was pretty epic. First bluegill of the season. Anyway, um, I forgot boots and my tennis shoes aren't helping that much. So right now, uh, I'm trying to like rub my feet. Like I can't feel my toes, I can't feel my feet. Um, I hope I don't get frostbite. My friend's coming with a heater. So right now I'm just trying to like rub them. It's like, Oi! Fish on, let's go. Show, them, show the camera. I got the fish. Yeah, this is our first ice fishing trip of the season, early ice on a suburb lake in Minnesota. So yeah, that's kind of what we're working with right now. Oh, I know what I can do. I can take this off and put it on my feet. Wow, would you look at that? Call me Genius Josh. There's about that much of ice, so probably like three to four inches. That's some pretty cold water too, I'd say. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty happy, even though I don't have boots. Um, first ice fishing trip of the season. Let's go. We'll update you guys when we get another fish. Fish. You got one? Mm -hmm. Nice. That's not a bad bluegill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, yes. another bluegill. I think the bluegills were on the bottom. They are. Yeah. Literally like, I mean, that's five feet of water, so probably like half a foot off the bottom. Yeah. Oh, there's a mark. I see it, yeah. Is that? I don't it's know moving up. What, what? What's going on here? Might be an air bubble. Like, oh yeah, it just popped up. Tayden sight fishing and I'm using the flasher. Um, this lake is pretty clear, so just using panfish baits. Sometimes bass will bite these little jigs, but mostly just targeting crappies and bluegills at the moment. Jeez, my flasher is blowing up right now. And I'm kind of sight fishing a little bit. Oh, that's, that's no, all, dude. That's all I've been doing. Yeah, they take it and they nibble it for half a second. You gotta really like wait, like you know, with carp. How you have yeah. to wait a bit for them to kind of suck it in. These guys are doing the same deal. They're schooling up, and apparently the wax worms don't want to stay on my hook. Big mark. So you see how it's like different from the ground, yeah. kind of? Yeah, yeah. I think he swam away, but oh no, he might be, still be there. That little hint of green above it. Yeah. Is that him coming up? Yeah, I think so. They're just finicky right now. 